Today is an educational training day. I don't think that our employees here fully appreciate the science behind our paper. Any thoughts on dinner? How about some place that doesn't give me food poisoning this time? <laughs> I know. Hey guys! <laughs> I know. It's that news. Great site. I was just reading up on some hydro salvation article. It's great reading. Oh, hey Sam. This is Sam. It's Sarah, actually. Oh, that's right. Sarah. <laughs> so let's have something simple. Does anyone know where paper comes from? Kevin? From the printer? No, not exactly. No, of course not, Kevin. No, it comes from organic... In the warehouse downstairs. I'd say the mood in the office is pretty uninterested. So paper is made of organically based compounds. Does anybody know what organic based compounds are? Okay, well, let's start from the beginning. Sometimes simpler minded people don't get things, which is perfectly okay. Don't get me wrong. I think the thing that they need is a little bit more of an entertaining way of learning. So we know that paper can be reinforced with lamination. Lamination requires plastics. Plastics requires the um, having phenols. Phenols are made with a benzene and a functional group. One of the most basic ways to make a phenol. You take a strong base with a substituted benzene ring as reagent. The OH acts, abstracts the H and the Cl acts as a leaving group. This is an elimination reaction step. So once the chlorine and the hydrogen have been eliminated, a benzene ring donates the hydrogen creating a benzene carbocation. Then, a nucleophilic attack to the benzene ring, forming a phenol. Can anyone explain in their own words what the phenol reaction is? Addition. I've got it. See, a true master of the martial arts knows to attack his opponent at the weakest point. If I were this hydroxide, I would want to- Hey, everybody. Right I'm Dr. Lyon. I'm a scientist. And I'm here to teach you about organic chemistry and phenols, because I'm a feline, because I'm a lion. Michael, that's a tiger. Oh, well, I brought puppets for everyone. Stanley, here's a puppet. I can't do this, it's not chemistry. I want the cat. Oh, here's a cat, Angela. <laughs> Kevin, think fast. Jim, Sam, here's one for you, two for you. Hey, there you go. There's random puppets over here, guys. Here, you even get one too, Sarah. I'm not so sure how much this puppet's have to offer here. Well, I'm not so sure how much you have to offer here, Sarah. I'm trying to talk about basic phenol reaction that make everything paper lamination to aspirin. Well, if your luck she's gonna be so boring, I'm gonna need an aspirin. Am I right, guys? Can anyone tell me in their own words how phenols are prepared? Kevin? Is it when two phenols love each other very much? Ew, Kevin! Kevin, get out! Sorry, I just don't think it would ever work out. 